thanks for watching this video today on uremic pruritus, which is itching, itching that is really bad, it doesn't seem to go away, and it's associated with the later stages of chronic kidney disease. Now, when I was in the later stages of kidney disease, I remember this, this itching that just doesn't go away, and it's really hard to control, and I, I used to get it on my legs, and I scratched to the point many times where I was bleeding. And back then, there weren't a lot of therapies or much you could even do about it. But fortunately today, with so much more research out there, there are some natural options that you can implement on your next trip to the uh, pharmacy or the next trip to your uh, health food store. So in this, uh, we're gonna cover an article that was in the Complementary Therapies in Medicine in the January 2021 issue. And it was titled, Complementary and Alternative Medicine Therapies for Uremic Pruritus, a Systemic Review of Randomized Control Trials. So they looked at a whole bunch of studies out there and they have about five things that they recommend. So the first three, which have shown to be pretty effective, was acupuncture, acupressure, or topical, so a cream of capsaicin. And what caps capsaicin is, is from chili peppers, okay? And they make this cream that you can put topically. You can find this at any, any, any uh, pharmacy. They have them in every pharmacy, and you use it topically, and it helps relieve a lot of that itching. So that's something that's a few dollars over at your local pharmacy that you can pick up. If you have access to acupuncture, acupressure, those are two things that have also shown to be effective. And then the other two things that they also listed was zinc and omega-3s, how they can help support good skin health and they can help with that itching sensation. So omega-3s are very important for kidney health. We discuss them a lot in other videos. I also talk about zinc and how when you have kidney disease, a lot of times you have low zinc levels or you're deficient in zinc. So it is recommended to take a little bit, whether in a multi, separately. But if you have uremic pruritus, you're looking to do something about it, try those five natural options which have shown to have some benefit. Acupuncture, acupressure, topical capsaicin, okay, which is uh, comes from um, capsicum is the herb, also known as chili peppers. You can buy that anywhere, and then there's zinc and omega-3s. And with the zinc and omega-3s, you wanna dose them properly. So take a look at our other videos about that. But if you're dealing with this, you're looking to do something, those are five options you have, and something that you can try uh, really within a few hours of watching this video, because you can just go to the store and, and pick up some of those items. Thanks for watching, everybody. We've got other videos about more you can do with pruritus, other articles on our website, a lot more you can do when it comes to taking control of your health when you have kidney issues. Thanks for watching, everybody. HealthyKidneyInc.com. Bye.